and I'm shopped here for years. I'm kind of sad it's going. Just surprised. More, more shocked, I guess, than anything else. It's the beginning of the end. Reaction from shoppers outside of Chapel Hill Mall after the news broke that this Macy's is one of 36 across the country closing up shop due to slumping sales. There's going to be a lot of displaced workers from what I heard. And uh, good luck getting a job. Kenitha Fetty works in a salon owned by a different company inside Macy's and believes the closing of the anchor store doesn't bode well for the mall's future. It's not going to last much longer. I, we, we've all kind of talked and have heard the, the talk between our customers and even store customers that it's going to turn into the next Rolling Acres. Rolling Acres Mall in West Akron closed in 2008. Since then, many photographs have captured the dilapidated conditions of the vacant building. Chapel Hill Mall has been in and out of foreclosure proceedings and then receivership in 2014. Councilman Bruce Kilby represents the area and is very worried about Macy's closing its doors. We need to try to attract another tenant in there as soon as possible. Kilby told me he'll meet with the mayor and stress the mall's vibrancy is a serious neighborhood issue. We uh, need to have a comprehensive plan for the entire Chapel Hill area, not just Macy's. Mayor Horgan hopes to have conversations with a company running the mall to discuss realistic options for the soon to be vacant store. It's really sad. It'll be sad for this side of town. Who could be interested in the big property is anyone's guess.